Hello everyone, welcome back to Evil Genius, looking at our Maximilian, how he is, well, motivating our researchers and, well, hopefully they're doing their job more quickly. 92%, that's exactly what we need, 100%, we're very close to that, to finally also be able to upgrade the world headquarters so that we can do higher quality missions and also our campaign mission, a golden beginning, so the security meters parts on the world stage. That's what we're doing here right now. This should be finished soon. Let's just have a look at our base. I'm feeling really good at it uh, right now. We have, though, uh, well, one major problem with the base, of course, that is this long corridor here that I can't negate. So this will probably just stay here. That's why this game or this map is a bit harder than the others. Um, it's this long distance and thus long commuting times between um, the two parts of the base. Um, the other problem that we still have, of course, and that is something we can do about, is, uh, first of all, our heat levels on the map and the other thing is the salaries now the salaries are really killing me at the moment we have 92,000 that we need to pay every yeah nine to ten minutes um, we only can store 96,000 um, so we have a problem we can store uh, almost as much money as we need for the salaries um, you know because you also need a bit of a headroom there we are building the vault here right now. My next goal will be to have the gold racks then. That we should really be um, going for so that we can store even more gold. But of course, it's going to be an ongoing problem. Now, my criminal network has been upgraded. There we have it now. Very, very good. I'm really inclined to go with one of the other um, heat um, techs that we have so far. But where was my gold? There it is, the safe rack. Um, we get the safe rack with that, we can store more gold. It cost me 22,000, that's rather ironic. Done. Saving or, well, building or um, storing a lot of gold costs a lot of gold. But well, there we have it, the next research we start right away. Um, there's a lot of money coming in right now, that is good, thanks to all the um, well missions that we're doing. We can cancel this one here now. Well, I'm, I'm really glad also that they changed the uh, way that uh, missions work on the world map, but still needing to cancel um, the heat levels every time that I want to start a normal scheme is a bit an extra click that just isn't necessary really. So I think they could work on that. Secure the meters parts. For that we need to upgrade now the criminal network here and for that I still need a bit more broadcast strength. That is something over here where we are already capped with our, well, space that we could use. Um, so one thing that I could do... Oh, first of all I think we can still um, make this a bit more workable by having <laughs> nah that's not that's not practical here at all perhaps i can still do it here nope all right so that's unfortunately all so we do need another control room and down here this might be a very good idea because we have the gold right the energy is fine for now so i would like to have the energy then in one of the other rooms but before I move the control room completely to the lower levels, I will definitely need to have two or three control rooms at the end. But what we can do right now still is we have the training room here, right? Um, and we actually finished now the training room on the other side. So there we have the training room. And this is going to be our major training room, right? We have lots of space here. We can expand. Um, and the training room needs to be also close to the mess room and stuff like that. The vault is going to disappear at some point. We can expand the mess hall then to the other side there. So there we have a bit of space that we can use. Um, and the training room should be really close to that. So I'm going to keep it here. That's fine. And for the training room, we now just need the proper equipment. First of all, I think we might still want to in increase that, the size of it. Um, we're also going into this area, perhaps, or we're doing something else over there. Who knows about that? There we have another one, another enlargement, 7,000 costs us. Money's really flowing, that's that's really good to see. Now the guards we are needing the most, so I'm going to have the guards as close as possible to the entrance. It's just something we need a lot of guards that we need to train. I will probably also have a second entrance for the, for the training room, right? Because it doesn't make sense to have um, only one entrance there. And there we have it, 82,000 our basic um, training room costs. The thing is though, of course, we can't uh, afford all of that. I will need to get rid of the other training room now, this one here. And there is a very good option for that by just, well, planting a wall over the whole thing. And we automatically sell everything that is also in between here um, and get the money in, of course. And there we have it. Being Everything is being sold now and we should be getting in a lot of money then again in return. And we can use all of this space here then, this very beautiful juicy space, for what? Well, basically for more control space. 
Perfect. Ah, and this is looking much better. So the only thing we now need is lots of these radio repeaters once again. And we have lots of space here to actually also expand them to some other tech later perhaps. Um, let's have two more radio repeaters here. And basically along the wall we can have now quite a lot of them. Energy wise we need to be still careful of course. Let's just see 15,025 energy. That's going to be five more broadcast strength. Let's make it six. Um, and then we could even squeeze in a few more. And of course in the center then as well. Perfect. Lots of space. That's beautiful. Um, here we can also now move the commuter consoles a bit more to the uh, the corners here that we have. And the same goes with my radio repeaters. So also here a bit more space that we have then. that we can use and we could also say for these computer consoles if I have enough scientists, scientists should work on them and I'm going to do this so this will actually count after they have been moved as well I hope. Let's just check this one out, very good and scientists have to work on that now. We have enough scientists and they will first of all be more reliable because minions always have jobs and getting assignments and stuff like that and on the other hand um, those scientists just work way more efficiently um, on generating us that intel. Now, meanwhile, my prisoners are ready for interrogation. Let's just find something, some juicy information from them and let the Research blood flow. Also, some of them need the archives, it seems. Do we not have enough space for that? No, we only have one and Research lots of people do resumed. need it now. So, since I do have a bit of money, let's build us another one of these re-education chairs. Um, over there, they're really, really expensive though, so we need to be careful about that. And how's it looking with my research? 58%. Yes. Do you still have something? Ah, work harder is not working. So we need to get this guy here over there and, uh, well, our genius Maximilian to also... Oh. Ah, come on. Let's capture this one. There's an agent with high suspicion level already, so he is not allowed to get out. Right, so we capture him as well. And the next one. We got the intel already. So Maximilian is going back to restore some of his morale. The training room is in full working order now. That's really great to see. So lots of training can be done if I need minions again. So I totally underestimated the amount of money it well needs for that, right? On normal difficulty, that was absolutely no problem ever. And on hardest difficulty, it really, really shines that you need to have a very careful balance of your income and your expenses. The next salaries are due in one minute and they cost me 94,000. We do have a couple of um, schemes running right now. Let's also just check the heat levels there. So here I'm reducing it right now in, yep, in Greenland. I'm also reducing my heat levels. Africa is looking a bit high there. So we might do some schemes, this one and this one. Here, I would like now to increase or upgrade my criminal network. To level two so we can do the scheme then and that is something i should by the way do now for all of the other parts as well um You're there for example once the scheme is over and in america right because i definitely want to get a lot of that Ninety-four thousand has been paid once again and we are totally close to bankruptcy as the wave of soldiers has arrived now too i thought i would still have a bit more time and my heat wasn't high enough so soldiers are going to slaughter some of my minions there once again and upgrading has started. Boom, there we have it. And the upgrade is worth way more than before now. So instead of 20, we generate 50 credits out of uh, every five seconds here. Also, the heat capacity has increased. So I think this is the threshold where it becomes dangerous then. And also, we do get now better quality schemes. We can also now start this scheme here. It takes eight guards, unfortunately. So that is not something I can do as long as these soldiers are in my base. Um, so I will still need to wait on that. We have enough broadcast strength. Please let me upgrade something. This is looking better now. It's still too high. There is pretty high heat levels. Alrighty. There we have the money scheme still running. Money scheme running. I can't do anything over there. This one's looking good now. Yeah, let's actually upgrade South Africa. Actually also cost me a bit of intel. Where are the soldiers? There they are, and they are of the Patriot faction. So America, now, what is really wrong here? We have low heat levels, except for Alaska, where it's pretty high. But still, this is already causing soldiers. I'm really, really, yeah, baffled by how quickly we uh, get there. Let's also upgrade now um, Eastern America, and also the East Coast, as it's called. And yeah, there we keep the money scheme. 
that's going to be a slaughtering. But I should also have now some better guards. And what I totally forgot about, of course, is the pistol rack. We can now finally have guards with pistols. Let's just build us two pistol racks right away. So we get about 10 pistols for all my guards. Very important that we have that. For now, for these soldiers, unfortunately, fists will have to do and clubs. Or perhaps we can do this before they arrive. Alright, research is at 83%. No researcher is available right now. Research has resumed. Where are my pistol racks? Come on, build them. A scheme ah, has succeeded. That's not going to be enough anymore. Soldiers enter. My guards should now see something. Activated. Yep, and they rush towards it. I'm also going to send my Barracuda over there. And my genius can work as well from afar at least. Some of them have the weapons already. That's good to see. Oh, they're equipping the weapons. Thank you very much. They're doing this on time. Ah, with fists, there's really no chance of actually doing anything against them. They are so strong. It's incredible. Where's my genius? He's not coming. Barracuda did a good job there too. Very good. Let's get rid of the body bags. They're reducing the morale. And please, yes, equip me the weapons. Perfect. I think we need another pistol rack. Let's have one more. They all want the the pistols, as we can see. Now I can go for the scheme. Eight guards. We need to spend on that, unfortunately. But that's going to be fine. And in Europe, it's now the heat levels are now low enough. So let's also upgrade one here. Our vaults are actually full. Payday is when in three minutes. Uh, we might want to do that. There we have now the next scheme level. Valets are temporarily reducing the, the heat levels. Very good. And another scheme for five scientists. But it produces me a lot of money. That might be something to keep in mind. Mm, and that's otherwise then pretty fine. Middle East. Uh, it's a bit higher there. Russia is definitely too high. Let's use a scheme there for reduction. And how's Japan looking? We can now abort that scheme and have a look at some money. Three more guards. Your no, I can't do that. Let's go for workers. Righty, my vaults are really full. Um, we are very close to the safe rack though. So that's what I'm going to invest my money in then. There is the gold rack. Perfect. This is going to, well, store a lot of gold for us. And we can continue with the next research. I would really like to go for the heat that builds up uh, more slowly. But I think we need um, some other stuff. The, the rate heat builds up at criminal networks. So the big screen is also really useful. Uh, research that we should be looking out for. Intruder protocol that we would have the first one distracting agents. So this is something that is very valuable, especially against agents. Um, lots of choices that we have right now. Let's go for the intruder protocol because I still am Research aiming for agents done. that um, most or well primarily come into my base and they get automatically then marked um, for distraction. And that's probably something very useful. Now payday, 80,000 we had to pay. We were able to pay all of them. That's good for now. And the money's flowing in again. And the money that we earn now, we can now also then use for the gold racks. And very good, the research we were also able to purchase at least that is something. Next mission we already have as well, hire more science minions. We actually need 30 of them. So I need to train more scientists. We have eight, let's increase this to 12 and use some of them for um, schemes so that we can consume them and also um, train more because I guess this is the whole idea behind it. Money is building up. While that is happening, let's use this momentum to sell the empty gold pallets that we have over there, right? Because no one really needs them and have the safe racks for that. They really cost a lot though, but they're going to be worth it because they can also store twice as much gold of for what I have, right? So let's build this whole row there. We need to keep a bit of an entrance there and I could even make this whole row there. Full. Let's actually do this one, right? This As money is flowing in quickly anyway, and we should have some optional objectives that we can finish as well to get a bit of gold in again. Ah, beautiful color, the gold for our little base. 
There we have our gold racks in all their glory already being filled as well. But we can now store up to 130,000 um, gold for now. That's a pretty good amount, I think. We, of course, still need to continue with that. Now, let's continue. Um, energy is a bit low. So once again, I will need to uh, do something about my generators. We still have the nuclear reactor. So I can actually think squeeze into here. That's fine for now without having any uh, to destroy anything, right? Um, so we can just do that. Very good. And only two more science minions for the next campaign mission. Let's also do a side mission. Let's not wait for the main uh, campaign to want us to do something. So we do have, for example, some new crime lords that we can have. We do have some loot. And I know there's going to be some loot missions that we need to um, finish. So let's just do one of them. And the cool thing is they give me nice items that also boost morale. Going against the grain with liberty and justice for you. So this is the independence, I guess. Um, freedom, well, you should do something about that. Let's do it. Absolutely headed with that smug, condescending woman. Whenever I look at her face, I want to scream. Who are you talking about, boss? Lady Liberty. She stands there with her torch and her book, while the rest of us are out here in the real world. Normally I'd ask if you wanted me to rough her up for you, but I don't know how to fight a statue. No, we won't fight her. We'll steal her. Or at least as much of her as we can fit in my office. Oh, interesting. So this is not the Liberty. Yeah. Do we have different side missions than, for example, um, with a Salikar? No idea. Let's come up with a plan. So we need to use one of my radio repeaters for that. Um, and then probably also one of my minions, right? And then we can get up there. Yep. Very good. The science minion. There we are doing this side mission there too. I love the mix between side missions and main missions. Has a nice synergy quite often. We do have some agents there again. Ah. This is the problem with not having the intruder protocol yet. Because you always need to look out for these agents. And when you plan something, um, you totally forget about time. There's usually three of them though. So there has to be another one somewhere. That I can't find. Oh. Is it in the lower levels? Nah. Okay. This would be... This would be bad. Lower levels in the training room, perhaps? No. Also not. Okay. Good. Then we don't have only... Oh, we only have two. We continue with upgrading the vault because it also passively generates more money for us then. And since we have the space and 46 energy, I would like to do that as well. So, control room. More radio repeaters. Let's have um, another one here in the corner. Righto. Here, we could still squeeze in a desk and then hopefully, hopefully it's possible. Yes, very good. We can squeeze them in like that. And there we have lots of them. So we can still have more than later. Four of them, four, five additional ones, six additional ones will be fine. And about the nuclear reactor, let's sell off those generators there. After all, we do have the money, right? And this gives me the opportunity of getting a few more nuclear reactors into my base and they just have a nice amount of energy this one and probably let's get rid of that one and have another one here can we do that very good 18 additional energy all we need but as we can see it's getting tight here so the expansion of my power room is going to be important as well one more science minion we need for the mission do i not have that science mission ah we still have to train one though where is this guy no one is. No one wants to become a scientist. Then we probably would have to spend those scientists on something, right? So let's just have a look. Four scientists, four guards, four valets for this money mission. There, it's a very good one. Let's launch it. And this uh, requires us to train more scientists. Research then again, here we are upgrading right now. Perfect. Boom. Level two we have. And oh, this gives me actually five scientists if I pay fifteen thousand gold for that. Doesn't sound half bad. Research this one we can resumed. actually cancel now and have another money scheme then running. There we are reducing heat. We have high heat levels across the board. Canada has been upgraded, but it has a super agent. Research this time I'm going to be very careful about how I handle super agents, right? They were already pretty strong on normal difficulty. Um, and this time I'm not going to try too much against them. Okay, your minions can only get close to the stature as a tour group. Send them into your cover operation to observe your guests so they Something can bring authentic flair to the job the later. The what? Room, learn to act. Alright, have workers learn to act at Baccarat. Let's have two tables for that. Dream. And the I other saw. thing is the golden beginning. Dig an entrance to the lowest level of the Doomsday Cavern. So we have the tack now it seems, or the basic of the tack. And now we need to find out more about it. The lower levels? What? 
A criminal network has been upgraded. This can't be right. I do need to get all the way to this level here already? That's like three levels below me. I thought this was would be uh, would have been the option. I'm really confused right now. What is going on? I need to get down here. How is this even possible? Can I do that? Not without getting to the better stone, I guess. There is the option. I think there is the option to do it. Right, but we would have to get up there. Research to this area. So that's where we need uh, the area here for. Alright. Very strange indeed. I did not expect that. I thought it would be that level here, but it seems like since we're starting from the top and we have to go to the bottom, it's going vice versa with the mission as well. Boom. That's a tricky one. Let's build here our little corridor, because here we can build the stairs then. That's going to be tricky. That's going to take some time and money. And on the other hand, I am also progressing now on the other mission, and then we'll see each other again. Stay tuned.